I'm really into being frugal and I'm also really into organic skincare. So today I am going to share with you how to be as frugal as possible with your fancy schmancy natural non-toxic organic skincare. So let's get into it. I found Pure Haven Essentials about six or seven months ago and I really ended up liking it a lot. It was a great alternative to a more expensive line that I was using. So expensive that I really was starting to feel pretty guilty about buying it. So um, luckily I found this alternative which was in many ways better than the line I had used before. Now some people will say, oh you're so biased because you carry the line. Um, in your business. I have no problem recommending a different product or just saying, you know, this one is not my favorite. Um, I actually use this one instead. But one section of the line, of the Pure Haven line that I absolutely adore and use every day and don't, don't ever plan on stopping is the skincare line itself. So um, one thing I am is frugal and I like to uh, make it last as long as possible and today I'm going to show you what I use and how I use it um, on a daily basis. One thing about this line is that it's super concentrated and very pure so a little goes a long way. And I'm going to link a really cool um, tutorial on how to clean your face, which sounds really ridiculous. It's really um, pretty straightforward, and if it, you can at least do this sort of ritual a few times a week, you will see a huge improvement in the quality of your skin. So um, the Pure Haven Exfoliator is something that I use just two or three times a week. Um, when I use it, it's typically in the morning and I won't even use the regular cleanser. So in the shower or at the sink, I'll go ahead and I would say probably pull out about a quarter, um, a little less than a quarter, maybe a nickel <laughs> uh, amount of exfoliator and the same process as the cleanser. Um, when I do this, I don't try to dig the granules into my face. I just try to do smooth swimming motions along my face. And I definitely will focus or concentrate in areas that are rough. So for me, that's just kind of around my mouth. Um, and I tend to be dry um, on the outer um, portion of my face. So first up, in the morning and in the night, I will use the toner. And this is gonna be the same as the makeup remover. I um, look into it and spray three times. So I do one, two at the top of my face, and then three sort of at the lower center. And I hold it kind of far away from my face, about like this, just to let the mist flow over. Now, a lot of people will go ahead and see the makeup remover and this toner and think, oh, I'll just spray it on a cotton pad um, and apply it to my face, but that's not the purpose. It's not really a applying it and wiping something away. It's to prep the skin and prepare it um, and to add some hydration. In the morning time, because I tend to have drier skin, I will go ahead and mix one pump of the serum, the night serum, and one pump of the hyaluronic acid. For a lot of people, you just want to go ahead and use the hyaluronic acid, one to two pumps. Um, one tip I have, I find really helpful, especially with hyaluronic acid, is to go ahead and spray your face with the toner. And then while you're still damp, absolutely make sure that while you're still damp, you use the hyaluronic acid or the hyaluronic acid and night serum combo. And again, just apply it to your face. For some, a serum is going to be enough moisture for day or night. Sometimes that's me. 
and most of the time it's not. So I use the moisturizer and I will show you how much I use. Then I take my eye cream and absolutely do this at night. If you wanna do it in the morning, go ahead. If we're trying to save money, don't use it during the day. It just kind of depends on your need. Um, the eye cream is a huge, generous portion. I don't know how anyone could ever go through the entire thing. <sighs> roses, roses, roses. I really just take a tiny dot like this and I tap it between my fingers and I apply dots around the eyelid and underneath the eye and then I slowly move the cream around. I save money and make my products last as long as possible and I absolutely want all of um, the clients to know that I do this because I, I think you should be able to spread it out as long as you can too. Um, and also the way that I use the products um, are, are very particular. So check out that video and start working on that routine too. A couple times a week, you'll love it.